Hello, everyone. RBG Kingdom Kid here back with some more Pokemon Legends Arceus. In the previous video, we did some side quests. And I did some stuff off screen. And I actually found the wide spin run area. So why don't we actually go do that one quest then that had that involved. If I can get that map back open. There we are. Uh, it was this one. So turn guidance on. And, of course, guys, off screen, I did what I did is capture some more Pokemon. Actually caught some new ones. I I have an Espeon because I have Eevee. And it evolved into Espeon. But now that I think about it, maybe I should have, like, not done that first. But it's not a big deal. So I have an Espeon. And I also found a Monferno. Um, where I found Monferno is basically, it was, it was, like, kind of around this area, like, up here. I was like, damn, it's like a fucking Monferno. That's crazy, so. And, of course, I was also doing some of the other, uh, um, things that they want you to do for the, uh, task as well. I actually caught another Eevee, and this time it was actually a, an Alpha Eevee, which is hilarious to me. Uh. What? That was weird as hell. Just my game crashing like that for whatever dumb reason. Okay, you know what? Fuck this. I'm just gonna... Well, before I fast travel. And then, before I even do that... Up. Uh, so yeah, so I got Espeon on me. I also brought Cheetah Dude in. I had Scyther on. I might stick with this uh, pack for a bit. Um... That's what I was saying. You know, I might as well just automatically connect whenever, so. Because then I can make sure to, like, see that stuff. Plus, like, this is one of those things where I will play be playing this game a lot more so at home than anywhere else. And even then, it's, like, not a big I guess it says connect whenever Wi-Fi is available, but it's, like, mm, it's not a big deal. Okay, so... Uh, but yeah, oh, right, I also caught a Munchlax as well. I found a Munchlax kind of around here as well. Uh, so that was kind of fun. Harris says she saw Will Wisp on widescreen at nighttime. Okay. I figured it was at nighttime. I mentioned this before and I'll mention it again. I really do love the fact that, like, you know, with the whole, with the Pokedex stuff here, you know, where you just go around and find the tasks and do all those different tasks and stuff like that. I think that's a really fun thing to do. It's really fun. And it's not like you, it's not like you have to do them all. Oh, hold on. What's this thing? It's not like you have to do them all either, which I think is pretty cool. Oh, these are the legendary Pokemon, because you have, uh, I think that's Palkia right there. You have the three, you have at least two of them. That's Yuxi, and I think that's Mesprit right there, and I'm going to assume this one on the bomb is, uh, Yuxi, Mesprit, and Azelf. Um, I think that's Regigigas right there below Arceus, which is at the top there. Um... Dialga? I I guess that could be Dialga right there. But that one's right there for sure. It's Palkia. Um, that could be ho -Oh in the middle. Uh, maybe that's Kyogre at the top right. That could be... Oh, actually, there's two... Yeah, no, that's two of them right there. There's two... Those two are there, and then those two are up there, too. So, it's like... Oh, that's Azelf right there. That's Azelf right there. At the, uh... That's a far thing here. And I don't know. Hmm. Weird. Uh, but yeah, uh... Fuck, lost my, lost my train of thought there. Um... But yeah, just running around. Been catch... I love that. I love that. It's like... And I, I actually... I did release some Pokemon as well. Um... And I also learned... So, uh... That's not really helpful right there, but... 
not you. Oh, shoot. I should have read that. Um, the Pokemon. So, the Buizel. If I just check their summaries, I can eventually see one that's maybe around two. Oh, shit. That one's close, but it's not what you're going on, so fuck me, I guess. Yeah, I got some more Pokemon. And Stanley, I got some more Zubats and stuff like that, so. You know, in all honesty, what I should do is I should actually nickname the Pokemon that I want to keep. You know, like the ones that would be like, these are the ones I would use for my party and such. And then, of course, like, you know, when it's like, oh, I need this Pokemon. Whoa! A Golbat. That's, it's not even an alpha. It's just a regular Golbat. Ah, oh, it's a Chimchar. I feel like the Pokemon hit so much harder in this game than they do in like the main story one or the the main line ones. Alright, we are the Chimchar you caught. I didn't really like see any other new Pokemon either, so. So will this automatically? Oh yes. So I can automatically report. We're catching efforts are quite clearly bearing fruit. How about a report then? So many Pokemon. Damn, close to 50. Should've just got one more. Caught one Alpha Pokemon, which was the Eevee. Um, got a lot with the back strikes, which is what I love. Caught three Pokemon for the first time, which would be Monferno, Chimchar, and Munchlax. Getting that money! Oh, it seems you've made some new observations. Let us have a look then. Blah, 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 blah. I've caught Starlies, and I defeat. No oh, man, if I just defeat five more of them, then all I have to do is focus on evolving them. Shinx just gotta catch a few more of them. Gotta defeat one more with a ground type move. Gotta see it with a quick attack. Gotta see it with bite and evolve twice. Gotta catch a few more worm poles. Uh, gotta defeat a lot more and gotta use poison stain and evolve it. It's great more about how Eevee evolves. Yeah, I was actually surprised like how close I was with the friendship on the Eevee already. Like, damn. Flame wheel, flamethrower, caught it without being spotted, and used an ember and gave it food, and evolved it once. Close. Just turn to the village. I was close, but only I caught like, I don't know, got like maybe another thing in there.
I, oh yeah, I also did see a few of the spirit things for spirit tomb, odd keystone thing. I didn't pick them up though. Have you come to show me the will o wisp I saw? That's it. That's the will o wisp I saw. All right. So it was a Pokemon all along. In any case, you caught it just like you promised. The survey card really are a talented bunch. Now I just have to explain the whole thing to Waka somehow. Can't say I'm looking forward to that. Yeah! A w -w -w Willow the Wisp! No, save me, sis! Ah! Ah! Willow the Wisp. Oh. Have they always been saying the the whole time? Do these people often mistake Pokemon for other things like I did with the Willow the Wisp? They have they said Willow the Wisp the whole entire time, and I'm just been like, yo, Willow Wisp. It's like, what the fuck? I'm an idiot. All right, what's your deal for today, buddy? Pokeball set. Sure. That's actually fairly cheap too. Thirty Pokeball. <laughs> Excuse me. I'm happy with that. Okay, let's upgrade my bag again, because I have the money. I wonder how high, my, how high I will go. All right, so skipping 3,500 just went straight to 4,000. All right, that's it for now. That's it for now. I need to have some money on me. My guess is 6,000 for the next one. So how much items can I hold now? Like, uh... Hmm. I don't know. I feel like... I feel like my I really wish I could get the bag to be bigger, but that's all fine, Danny. Uh top floor. Cause now we gotta see what uh Mars is an ancestor wants. Filled Azura? Azuri. I guess we're gonna go after another noble Pokemon here or something. Hmm, so let's come to Ursuluna as well. This suggests that even Pokemon that are not nobles can be can become frenzied. I have re received no word from Adamant or Irda, but this is not something we can simply ignore. In any case, you have make you have my thanks, Miss Arizu. You did well to inform us of Urs Ursuluna's situation. Is that like an evolved form of Ursarine or something? No problem. Adamant's got his hands full running our clan and all, and Ursa Luna's warden wouldn't even give me the time of day. So the galaxy team are the only ones I could turn to this. Ursa Luna's warden is Mistress Kalaba of the Pearl Clan, is it not? Of all the wardens, she is the most narrow-minded, <clears throat> bound by his tradition. She likely does not take kindly to outsiders meddling in her affairs. So what, do the Pearl Clans only watch noble Pokemon? I have a new mission for you, Andrew. I urge you to study Ursa Luna in the Crimson Marylands. I permit you to show your strength if necessary. Oh, sweet. That's why I need to go to do a lot of side quests. The next area you'll be sent to investigate is the Crimson Mar Marylands. You'll find the Pokemon living there to be more fearsome than those of the Obsidian Fieldlands. Even the landscape itself is harsher with steep ra ravines and seaside cliffs. It is not welcoming. At your current rank, you should be able to handle the Crimson Marylands on your own. My guess is you have to be like a two rank or a three rank. Here's what you need to know. Your destination is a place within the Marylands known as the Solakion Ruins. 
that is where you'll find Ursaluna's Warden. Alrighty. <clears throat> I wonder if I can travel from areas to areas. Like, uh... If I can do, go to, one, like, the one area, then go to the Obsidian Field Lens without having to, like, come back to the village or something like that. That'd be nice. Oh, hello, Andrew. I was just getting to itch the bow with you, and now here you are. It must be a sign. You're right. Let's have a fine battle so I can go closer with Pikachu. You have more Pokemon than just Pikachu? You do. You have another one. Ah, okay. oh, you have a Mime Jr. Go. Cool Lava. You don't know a dark type move. I should know. Is Mime Jr. Fairy or is it Psychic? I can't remember. I think it's just Fairy. Thunder Wabe. Good, good, cool, Lava. Roll out. Fuck you. Seriously, fuck you. All right. Oh, that's cool. All right, electric is weak to ground, not rock. There we are. Now give me some money. Oops, I keep finding myself caught up in observing the way the Pokemon use their moves. Maybe she's, maybe she'll be the, uh, I don't know. Like, maybe the rivals will grow up to be something else other than this. Pikachu may not be very happy with me after that. Thank you for bad with me. Here, have this new recipe. Come up with a new recipe. Stealth sprays. One hobo berry and three bug warts. So I've been working on studying these strange space-time distortions. Do you know the ones I mean? They've been appearing here and there lately. It seems like they hold wonderful items, but frightful strong Pokemon too. If you plan to go into one, be careful about it. Now, time to head to Mar Maryland's camp. Hey, got a new location. My guess is the spots between... So, okay. There might be something up here <clears throat> at some point. Maybe. But I don't think there's anything right here because wherever these green mountains are, those are areas that you will not be able to go to. Because they're like the borders. So, maybe something in here, maybe? Or something over there? Oh, well. Oh, well. Let's go to a new area. It's raining currently there. It's raining, man. I said it. Hallelujah. It's a raining, man. Alright, new area, new Pokemon. So, today, obviously I'm recording this even before the series is out. Um, Pokemon Go actually has an update where you can actually catch Hisui Voltorb. Grass Electric, which I think is a cool combination. Um, and I've gotten so many of them, so I can't wait till we get that. Here we are, my boy. The Crimson Marylands. An area teeming me with poison-wielding Pokemon and plenty of other besides. I've heard about your mission, Andrew. If you're looking for the Sulkin and Ruins, they're off that way. Yeah, but I kind of want to explore a little bit here first before I go that away. For now, I'll keep searching for those space-time distortions. There's little way of knowing when or where one might appear, but I'll do my best. 
it sure would be handy if my map could tell me. All right, space-time distortions. Space-time distortions are dangerous places where powerful Pokemon appear. However, if you're brave enough to enter them, you might be able to find rare Pokemon and items inside. I'm counting on both of you to carry out your survey work as best as you can. But be mindful of your limitations as well, won't you? If all Pokemon are giving you trouble, I suggest you go to the training grounds and have Captain Zizu teach your Pokemon some strong moves. Shit! That's actually what I wanted to do. I wanted to actually go do that. If Koyo at the general store could get some different goods in stock, I'd have more to sell. Oh, that's what they were saying. Okay. Yeah! Don't worry. I, I want that too. I'll sleep till morning, I suppose. So I'm actually going to go back into town because I was actually wanting to change some of the moves up or at least teach some of the moves to some of my Pokemon to see what they could do. So I want to do that first. And also... Yep, there's some bags around here, but also some side missions. Okay. Maybe this is the area where I'll find all those other things. Alright. Damn it, I keep hitting B. I don't know why. Hey, I heard you raise your ranks. Now I can teach your Pokemon some new moves. So what can I do for you? All right, oh, Kalava. Let's see what you can learn. Rock Smash, Aerial Ace, Rest, or Iron Tail. Iron Tail would not be a bad thing. Same with Aerial Ace, if I'm being completely honest. What about Scyther? What can Scyther learn? False Swipes, Rock Smash, Swift, Ominous Win. Focus Energy, Calm Mind, X Scissors. Oh. Should give him next, but I feel like that's a move he'll learn regardless. Oh shit, he can pick up multiple ones. Okay, cool. Not you, dude. What can you learn? Rock Smash, Bulldozer, Stealth Rock, Fire Punch, Thunder Punch. God damn. Okay. Lucio. I kind of want to teach you maybe the Fanes. Iron Tail won't be that bad either. I can go and give you at least the feints. Espeon won't chain you get. Calm mine. Ooh. Ooh. Game both of those would actually be pretty good. Now, you are definitely more so of a special attacker, so... Zen Headbutt would not be good. A calm Mind would actually not be bad. So, giving you a Calm Mind. And maybe these two as well. Hmm. I love that you can just give them the skills, whatever you want. You don't need to, like, change, the, like, go to a, a move learner or something. I mean, she's technically the move tutor in a way, but... Eh, nothing for you. What can you learn? I think that's hilarious that he, that uh, they can learn that. Ooh, Shadow Claw won't be that bad. You're probably more of a attacker, yeah. Definitely will give you the punches. What about Monferno? I'm curious about Monferno. I'm sure Monferno has the same stuff. Yeah. But you got Poison Jab as well. And some different stuff. So that, that Eevee right there, you can tell by the red mark by its gender that that was an alpha Pokemon. Did I catch any other EVs or did I? Oh, I've actually only gotten those two EVs, huh? Okay, I think that's good for now. So. Let's change your moves up. Let's give you Calm Mine. 
and Dazzling Gleam for now. I do need to see you use, um... I do need to see you use Baby Doll Eyes, but once we're done with Baby Doll Eyes... Uh... Did I just... Fluxio new moves? I think I did. Yeah, I taught him the, I taught him the feints. Um, let's give him an Ice Fang, because we don't have anything with the Ice Fang for now. Uh, Thundershock. That's fine for now. Quick Attack is also just a good thing to have in general, I suppose. Um. That's my train of thought. Oh, yeah, Pokedex. Pokedex, Pokedex, Pokedex. Yeah, with, uh, with Espeon. So you guys see it use baby doll eyes 15 times, and then a guy used psychic 40 times. So as soon as it does the baby doll eyes, that many times, then I'll swap that out for maybe shadow ball. And I think that'd be a good ass pool of moves right there. Okay, let's check out. Let's see what new Pokemon are here. <gasps> A Padoo! There's the grass thing that that one guy wants. Evolve the three times, given it food five times, absorb, defeat, daylight without being spotted. Okay. Oh, does he not like? Food disappear before he could get it. Well, shit. I don't even want to know like how absorb would work. Go faster, you little bastard. What? <sighs> Are you fucking kidding me? Thank you. But that one probably saw me, so. What's this thing? Oh, okay. Press the right button. And more food a couple times. Bad. 
Ah, oh, it's a car. Uh, it's a car. Carnav carnivine. God, I broke out. Are you fucking serious? I can actually get a good grass type. Yeah, got six. Let's see if we can catch that carnivine. Times you stun it by using items. Strong move, acid spray, defeat with the fire, flying types, and large specimen, okay. And alpha specimen, okay. Pokemon can steal the mud or the like, raising the chance that the Pokemon will evade opponent's moves. Okay. Do one more call out. I the health thing also matters in this as well. I mean, granted, you can't just catch him at full health, so it's not a big deal, but. Nice, Sue. Carnivine. Why is the music playing as if something's after me? Oh, I got that was a heavy one? Damn, okay. Uh need to defeat a few more. I do need to capture a couple more without being spotted, so. and got some of that mushroom. <gasps> A Pikachu! Catch light specimens without being spotted. Thundershock, Thunderbolt. Different forms. Okay. And what the fuck? And I have to evolve it three times. That's a female one, I believe.
Oh, no, no, that's a female. Yeah, it does have the heart, heart tail. Oh, bitch. Pandara wave, yeah, it has no effect on it. On this campfire. Actually, reminds me. There's a quest over there. Good iron chunks from that one. That's good. Yo, that's a new one. I think that's just a regular pair sack. Catcher, Alpha, it's caught, it's defeated, numbers you defeat of a flying type, Venom Shock, style moves. Large specimens defeated, fire moves. That does kind of look like a large one. That large one, though? Nope, guess not. Does that not count as stunning it? Oh. I think. I had to use mud balls. Mud balls are what stun them. Do I actually have mud balls? All right, I think I put them all in my in chest. I don't know, I had one. I don't have more, so let me go grab those and see who has this request for me.
Graceful Pokemon. Hey there. You're that goat getter from the Survey Corps, right? I have a request for you, if you got the time. I'd love to know more about Pokemon called Roselia. It has those gorgeous red and blue flowers for hands. Such a graceful Pokemon. I often come to the Golden Lowlands to admire the Roselia, but just watching them from afar isn't enough for me anymore. Do you think you could complete Roselia's page in that Pokedex version and show it to me? Yeah, I could do that. A beautiful rose has thorns. Yeah, so if I'm being completely honest, I'm still trying to figure out, like, how exactly I want to go about with this game. You know, with in terms of, you know, uh, Let's Play and such. Obviously, I'm going to do the story, because, duh. But then it's like, what do I do after? Can you please go a little bit... Oh, you dumb bitch. Go faster. Oh, my God. And then get in the ball. Could probably start making some great balls soon, too. I really need to. Oh, that was kind of as daylight hours? Okay. I do like how they have this field. Oh, hello. Hi. Flame wheel, baby. What the hell? Ghastly! Ghastly's replaced the Bidoos. I actually kind of like the effect that they have with the, uh, the ghost, the gas effects around it. You scared it off with a Scatterbane. Of all the three times astonished ghost type moves, Caught at night. Please stay. Yes. Ghastly actually looks kind of cool. Trifecta. one more. Then I have the ones for night. If I catch one more... I 
Poseidic stuff. Heavies. I need to catch five of them. And I need to catch 25 of them in general. Haven't fought any. I haven't defeated any with electric type moves. I don't think... Oh, yeah. I have Luxio with me. I was like, do I even have electric type moves? Is that heavy? Nope. All right. Let's give you a little snacky snoo. You actually get there fast, unlike fucking Badoos. It's funny seeing Psyduck being serious. Hit it with a Thunder Fane. Okay, so in terms of I could go here. You know what? Let's go get that bag. If I can, hopefully. I have to cross the water first. Oh god, I was about to say, fuck me. A hobo berry. Oh, okay, I, and I don't have any room for it. Okay, well, let's see here. Maybe I can make some stuff. Seriously? Well, then again, I do have some stuff that I should put away like this. And that, and this, so... What the hell? Oh, the caster fan. Okay. Pokemon that dwell and wander among the fields love these grains and will gather wherever the stalks are thrown. Okay. It's a lore type. In a way, uh... Oh, what to craft? What to craft? I have 22 heavy balls. I don't have any sky tumble stones, which I think that one bit of rock I saw was probably what will make those. You know what? Let's make as all the great balls we can. Whoa, that's an Alpha 10 growth, isn't it? Yeah. That didn't count either. How the fuck am I supposed to? S How the fuck am I supposed to s uh, fucking stun it? That's the word. Oh, 
Oh, right. You're a ground type. Oh, my God. That's adorable. Ground water. Not bad combo. A new Pokemon. Let's see if I can catch one more ghastly. Let's say Krogan's poison's medical properties evolved it, different forms, scatterbane, mud bomb, psychic moves, and defeated. Seriously? Oh well. Psychic. What confusion on psychic? Don't use a uh, fairy type move because it's a poison type. Potion. Oh man, that it woke that one up. How can a move like baby doll eyes miss? Roselia.
Wanna be a little bitch? One more baby doll eyes in the mouth. Smash it with the gun. Oh no, he had one with a moonstone. Damn, okay. That's a big Badoof. Badoof, be doof. That has to be part of the heavy. Yep. Caught during daylight, defeat the psychic, poison powers, and number of different forms I've obtained. Might as well use the potion. How you saw me is beyond me. Still with the confusion. Can't you see this is the land of confusion? Oh damn! I didn't realize how long I've been going for this part. Okay, that's not the map. Okay, uh, guys, I think that's gonna do it for this part of Let's Play Pokemon. Legends Arceus in the next part, guys. We will, um, let's actually go do the story for a little bit. So that sounds like fun. So, thank you all so much for watching this video, guys. If you like the video, please give a like button, a click, and comment down below what you like about the video, didn't like about the video, and let me know what you guys think of the new area. I like it with some new Pokemon around, some of my favorite Pokemon. You all know, yeah, guys, know I like Crow Gunk. Um, I really like the uh, Roselia line, um, Carnivine, finding found a Pikachu, and stuff like that. I like it, so yeah. As well as guys, hit the subscribe button so you don't miss a beat and subscribe to the main channel too. That's in the description below. As well as find me on Twitter, both my main Twitter, RBG, Kim Kid, Twitter are in there too. Speaking of which, I'll, I'll, I'll organize my items too when, when I'm done. Thank you all so much for watching once again. And I'll see you all next time.